Hi guys, welcome to Cook to Nourish. One thing that I really missed when I first started on AIP was uh, my coffee. And I like to have coffee with milk and sugar and that creamy, you know, coffee latte was something that I could not have, uh, I mean, could not enjoy or recreate with without milk, right? So, so I really missed it, even though after a period of eight months or so, I had introduced coffee and I used to drink black coffee, but, you know, a coffee latte, a good, delicious coffee latte was something that I missed. Uh, to create this recipe, over time, I have created something that I really, really enjoy, and I'm sure you would too. Um, number one, it doesn't have any caffeine. It has chicory, which is actually good for your gut. It is a prebiotic and it feeds the good bacteria. So it's really good. And uh, plus it has no caffeine. So it also has some other good ingredients. It has good fat from coconut milk and coconut oil. And also has a small amount of gelatin, which is actually good again for your gut. And uh, it's good for your hair and skin and nails, etc. So all in all, this is a great recipe and I am guaranteeing you that you're going to like it. It's absolutely delicious. All right, so I'm gonna show you how to make this. So we start off first by brewing the chicory. So I'm gonna add about one cup of water um, into my coffee pot, a coffee maker. And uh, then I'm going to add the chicory that I need here to brew. So I'm just going to be doing this for one cup. And I have um, this chicory here from that I ordered from Amazon. It's called Starvest Botanicals and it's organic. And I really like this one. And the important thing here is the ratio or uh, you know what, what how much quantity of chicory you use is important. Actually very little goes a long way. Uh, so one teaspoon of chicory is what I use to brew for uh, you know one cup so <clears throat> you know that gives a nice uh, strong as well as uh, uh, slightly bitter taste if you add more it is going to become more bitter so perhaps you can experiment but I would say start with one teaspoon so now I've added the one cup of brewed coffee I'm sorry chicory and uh, adding two tablespoon of coconut milk now, of course, if you are not doing AIP and if you can use nut milk, then you can use any other nut milk like almond milk. And I'm adding one teaspoon of gelatin powder here. Now, see, you use the inner you know, gelatin, not collagen. And then one teaspoon of coconut oil. And then I'm going to use maple syrup as a sweetener here. Uh, so I'm adding about a teaspoon. Sometimes I add even less than that. And you can skip it all together for a keto version or use some other sweetener like stevia. And now I'm using this cuisine art. So as you can see, I was pouring all of these things into the, you know, the base of that cuisine art. And that way, you know, it's a good... Uh, Way for, to prevent everything from coming out so I really prefer this hand mixer or hand blender to blending this in a regular food processor or blender because it's just so easy to clean up to and you just blend it till you it gets frothy and then pour it into a cup to serve and by this time it's it gets a little like uh, less hot right because you're adding the other ingredients so I just uh, you know place it in the microwave for like 20 seconds or so so that it's really hot now you can also add some carob uh, or cocoa powder if you can tolerate it to this and then it becomes like your mocha latte right thanks for watching if you like this video Please like and subscribe to my channel. Visit cooktonourish.com for more recipes.